going to work after like what a month or two that i haven't been i'm in a rush right now just because um i feel like i'm late i like to go when they first open just because our tip out is so high so that hour or two before other girls start showing up i like to go ahead and get my tip out of the way just so the rest of the day can be like my profit or whatever so i'm late i probably could have made my tip out by now but we're gonna stay positive just like brie be saying we're gonna make some money today we're gonna make some money today so yeah i'm trying to get my mindset right on the way over there um yeah i didn't want to go but i need to start saving some money so we're gonna go and see what's up hopefully today is a good day i'm praying today is a good day like please don't waste my time like Oh, I'm going to be so pissed if my time is wasted. But we're trying to stay optimistic. And um, yeah, I got some breakfast, a little smoothie or whatever. I really want a Red Bull, but I don't have time to stop because I need to go ahead and just, I need to go. I need to be out there already. But yeah, I'm on my way and hopefully today is a good day. I'll check in with y'all later once I'm like dressed in, um, in the locker room or whatever. behind those curtains i would not do that like what why we need to go behind the curtain i'm not doing those but they got a pool table back here fish tank and then i would definitely do like this but not that no so i left the club i was there from like what one to like eight it was really slow today i'm gonna do a money count in a minute but i just want to talk to y'all a little bit before i go inside yeah today was just really not it i got blessed a little bit and you know what i'm saying at least i made my tip out back which is like i hate to even say that but like sometimes you be fighting to make your fucking tip out back but yeah so i made my tip out and i got blessed um i don't think i made my second goal my first goal was to make my tip out that was first because it's my first day back i don't know how it's been i don't know if it's been slow this club is like eh, i don't know i really know i want a new club or i don't even know if i want to keep doing this i just want it to be worth it like if i'm going into a club to do this like i at least bare minimum need to be walking out with 600 a night plus like 600 or more a night like this little 100 200 like bruh I know it's day shift, but still, like, it's the principle. Like, I'm taking off my whole entire clothes. Like, I could do it. I could do weight. Like, I was making this type of money waitressing. Like, I had that one day that y'all saw already that I made, like, um, 400 or, like, close to almost 400 or whatever. But, like, yeah, I need more days like that. But I really need to be making 600 plus, like, minimum. Like, if I'm going to be doing all it is, it's the most. It's doing the most. It's doing the most. And putting up with men, like, oh putting up with men is really just putting up with the men like literally that part of the job is like oh it's meant it's on your mental like you have to really be like mentally prepared to deal with men because child but yeah i'm about to go inside um do a money count i'm really tired um i'm really really tired y'all my first day back and i just feel like oh my god like it really do feel like my first day like I know my body's going to be sore as hell tomorrow. But yeah, today was just kind of shit. I got blessed, luckily. Thank you, God, because I was going to be livid. Like, I literally told my friend, I said, if I don't need at least make 100, 100, including my tip out, so that really means 170. Like, if I didn't make 170, I was walking out that door and I was never going back to that club. But I guess the Lord was like, give it another chance. I might go tomorrow, but I just know I'm going to be sore tomorrow. Um, it's usually how it is. Like, I'll feel it the next day, like, times 10, but yeah we gonna see we gonna see but i'm about to go inside um shower i need to feed myself because i haven't ate all day i don't like to eat on shift because then i get lazy and i don't want to move and i want to do nothing so yeah i'm about to go inside shower because i smell like a fucking ashtray and yeah the club smell bro they don't tell you about this in these stripper vlogs but like club smell is so gross bro like you walk out and you're like Ugh like because it's like all those different smokes all those different smells everybody's like different scent like oh uh, just team too much
realities. The money can be so dirty and gross. That's why you don't count money on your bed or anything that you feel nice. You count it on the floor, on a towel, old blanket, stuff like that. Because sometimes the money be dirty, okay? And I'm sectioning these off in 20s. So they're in 20s and I can just count it faster that way. <laughs> sectioned it all off i'm gonna show y'all what it looks like and then we're gonna talk about the total of what i made today and again i told y'all my expectations weren't too high i really said as long as i made my tip out but i want it at least 100 because it's like if i'm going i might as well make some profit but yeah so i got blessed this one guy blessed me but yeah so we're gonna talk about what i got and i'll just show y'all how i sectioned it off or whatever so these right here are sectioned off in 20. So you have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and then that's one, 20. And then these are for 20s, the big bills, and then I got two fives. So in total, okay, so what I do is take my phone with the calculator instead of like counting it all together. Ain't nobody got time for that. So 120 plus 80 plus 10. So in cash, I have 210 and then this one guy paid me in cash app. I don't recommend that y'all do this just because some people can get it disputed, like with their bank and stuff. So don't do that necessarily, but because it was so slow and today was like a struggle day, I allowed it. Plus I had a conversation with the guy and he just seemed genuine. But again, I don't recommend it because they can dispute it and then you'll lose your money or whatever like that. So yeah, in total, I made 250 and we have to take away 70 for the um, tip out. So let's go ahead and do that. So I'm walking away with 180. I wish I could have made more. I felt like I could have made more. We just need more clientele. The clientele to girl ratio is just, uh, it's horrible. So yeah, that's pretty much today. Um, I don't know when I'm going back just because I don't really have time for this. Like, like I said, I prefer every time I step in there to walk out with like 600 plus because this is play money, it's chump change. And I just, I'm not with it. So I don't know. I'm trying to think of a master plan. Um, I don't know if I want to go to a different club, if I want to do something else, but it's not a lot of legal ways to make a lot of money really, really fast so yeah we gonna see but yeah that's pretty much the end of this video um i didn't get a lot of footage just because i try to respect everybody and not put them in the video like without their consent type of thing and i just don't you know what i'm saying like i don't want to do that because i don't want nobody to do that to me like if i didn't consent to be in your video don't be putting me on videos don't be putting me on social media don't be doing none of that if i didn't consent to it so i try to give people the same respect but I'll catch y'all in my next vlog if I decide to go back. I might, most likely will, just because I need to save. But yeah, I'll see y'all in my next video. I love you guys.